y'all welcome back to another reaction video I'm not gonna lie this has been long overdue it's been a whole fucking month since this came out to be honest i've been binge playing a lot an unhealthy amount of dead by daylight i need to be stopped from playing the game honestly it's so fun but it's so aggravating but it's so like addicting you know one of those games anyway though again about a month ago they re released this spider-verse short film thing i don't know if it's based on spider-verse or if it's just like canon or like whatever before a certain film after a certain film whatever you know the case may be if you happen to know fill me in in the comments below you know on whether or not this is canon or if it's some other shit but yeah enough yapping let's get into this hit play oh yeah uh what full screen right yep and then hold on peep the appropriate drip you feel me okay but yeah anyway sony pictures animation okay he's walking home it's a lot to deal with Yo, let me say something real quick. In short, you never know what someone's going through. This kid's going through so much shit and obviously like it's fiction and shit like that. But like, like some of the shit he's going through, like, you know, we can relate to. Me personally, I'm not in school, but uh, I do remember like, you know, just stressing about school when I was in school and shit like that. And, uh, you know, he, he's thinking about uh, what his dad was saying. I forgot what specifically he said, but his dad was like kind of scolding him or like whatever you know everyone goes through shit man so like already like nice like this is kind of like relatable okay oh my god oh my god hold on all right you're you're, you're probably like wait what hold on wait go back okay dude okay I I'm, I'm gonna put it simply i don't know about you guys but like me before i like go in the house or whatever sometimes like i just need to sit in my car and just like do nothing just think or like just stay or like whatever you know like i need to like decompress before i come in the house to decompress you know what i mean especially after like a long day so like that's exactly what miles just did right there like when he like he's like hesitating to kind of go inside okay yo i'm home sorry i'm late that You're really not gonna turn around and check right <laughs> <laughs> Nah, that was crazy. <laughs> you gotta keep, keep your head on the swivel. <laughs> I know. Head on Dad. a swivel, yes. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. Okay, okay, so we got pizza on the way, ice cream in the freezer. Oh, and Miles, check this out. I rented three scary movies we can watch. Three! Rent? Did you drive all the way to Jersey to do that? Uh, you got jokes now, that's good. A call couch? Nah, I would, but I'm just tired. I'll catch you next time. Uh, Are you okay, son? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. Copy that. Yo, Miles, come on. Don't be slamming my door, man. Yeah, sorry, Dad. He kind of bugged. Did he slam the door? I don't think so, but... Spider-Sense going off? He's trying to escape the world. It'd be like that. But he's reminded of, you know, whatever problems he may have. And these being all the problems. Notice, like, we seen, like, before he walked in the house or whatever, like, like he was having these same, like, uh, thoughts, flashbacks, whatever. So that's why he had to decompress before coming in the house. But also, like, part of his 
you know problems are in the house too kind or whatever you know with his family and shit you know like he's he's sitting down like he's putting his headphones on blasting music to you know escape everything for a little bit but like he's still thinking about it it's hard to like not think of or whatever you know what i mean but, yeah like it's it's relatable Yo, he said, oh man, I'm bugging. <laughs> Yo, Gen Z slang in movies is crazy. I, I don't mind it. It's cool, but it, it it's cool because like they wrote it and like the voice actor said it in like the right context and the right way or whatever, you know? So like it's not it's not bad. I'm cool with it. But <laughs> yeah, that was nice. That was that was cool. Okay. Oh, I oh I understand what's going on. Okay, I I understand what this is, what this is, what it's for. It's essentially this is literally like exactly like what I was just talking about. So I think what this whole thing is, it's like some like relatable type shit to help you with your mental health. I didn't really look at any of this shit, so let me see real quick. Everyone's going through something, even superheroes like Miles. Okay, yeah, no, this shit's dope though. Yeah. So this is like PTSD. No, 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 no. My bad. Sorry, no. This is not PTSD. This is sleep paralysis, right? Sleep paralysis, I'm pretty sure. If I'm not mistaken. Or PTSD. It, 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 I don't know. No, sleep paralysis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sleep paralysis. Yo, that's crazy though. Imagine. This looks cool as fuck though. What the fuck? <laughs> oh hell no. Oh that's crazy. Oh hell no. Yo! Oh, hell no. Yo. As soon as I seen the face, how- uh, As soon as I seen the giant face emerge, I know exactly what that is. I'm bouncing. I'm fucking running the opposite way. Oh, no. That's crazy. Yo. A spider in the mouth is crazy, y'all. Oh, my God. You know what? Honestly, like, it would be really cool if we seen more shit like this. Maybe, uh, or well, yeah, actually, if we see more shit like this in Spider-Verse and animated shows or whatever, but also just as well live action movies too. I don't know why, or like, I don't remember why or like what people said about it specifically, but I do remember like, people saying about tasm 2 they didn't really like the ptsd aspect of the film with like andrew like how he kept seeing gwen's dad but yeah no like i i thought that was cool though so i don't know L like 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 it's it, it can be relatable so like you know i don't see why people wouldn't like it so if you like this you should like that in tasm 2 but i don't know anyway let, let's continue Oh, he's awake now? Wait, my bad. I gotta go back one, like, real quick. I'm lost. When did he wake up? Or was it just right there? I don't know. That was kind of confusing. But, okay. Hey. Hey, Dad. You got a minute? Yeah, what's up, son? Can we get some air? Of course we can, yeah. Grab your jacket. 
I just got so much on my mind, you know? I hear that, yeah. So tell me what's going on. It's just like homework, girls, well, one girl. Yo, that, that shit, that shit was dope, bro. That shit was fire, bro. This is a fucking W, bro. Another thing I like about this, too, is that this is essentially, like, anxiety, too, right? And, like, I, I, I'm i diagnosed with anxiety. Um, more social anxiety, I guess. But, you know, in, gen in general, I have it, though, right? And chances are, like, you probably do, too. I, I feel like everybody does. It's different though like everybody has it at different levels but now see this right here this is where like the anxiety starts or whatever right it's little like it's noticeable but like you know you keep it pushing you're chilling or whatever kind of right then you know it starts to grow it starts it starts like you know kind of right now and like what what it's gonna start doing after it's gonna start fucking with you and shit and like people may or may not notice or whatever depending on how like how much it affects you or whatever you know but then eventually sometimes like no matter how much you want to escape it's gonna keep coming at you or whatever i guess right until you eventually kind of just face it however that should be done you know and then it essentially just kind of gets better once you or maybe not once but like after you confront it or whatever and maybe you talk with somebody about it or whatever so yeah that's really dope again i fuck with this shit heavy the, the show is fire bro what did you think of this spider-verse short film i thought it was hella fire and like you know relatable in my opinion this is like what kids need nowadays this is what spider-man is about he's relatable with that being said i want to hear your opinion so make sure to comment down below so i can interact with you in the comments thank you for taking time out every day to click on this video if you're new to the channel i usually try my best to cover confirmations rumors leaks regarding spider-man media and whatever else i'm interested in so if that's what you're interested in hit the subscribe button we're on the road to 6k don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed this video and to check out my last upload at the top left hope you have had a good day and that you enjoyed the video 